I'm gonna go get some pothos and I'm gonna put them in my aquarium. I'm actually making a stop at Jewel first. I'm gonna get Brittany and George some friends. Here we go, folks. The sweet potatoes. These look pretty good. All right, so while I was sorting through the potatoes, finding the very finest sweet potatoes to grow in my tanks, I came across some pothos in Jewel. I was gonna go to Home Depot to buy them, but turns out Jewel sells them and they're only $5 per pot, which really is not bad. I ended up getting like five of the pots. I was there like having my arms stuffed with potatoes and pothos. Uh, I spent about $36, but for these plants, it's a good deal. All right, I'm home now. I got the pothos. I thought we should just say hi to the chickens. Say hi to YouTube, Jenny. All right, so I made this real sketchy setup. Don't know if this is gonna last long. I'm gonna take the pothos, put them in these little things, put them in here, maybe fill some rocks in there, and that's how we're gonna get them suspended on top of my tank. Okay, so I got my pothos, and I'm gonna wash away all the dirt in this bucket. Uh, you don't really need the dirt, and sometimes the dirt can kind of make the water dirty, or the, the fertilizers in the dirt can mess with it, so it's uh, better to do away with it. Here we got the plant, and we're just gonna, we're just gonna let it, just gonna push it out and we're just gonna kind of carefully break up this root clump look at that they're cuttings from other pothos you can see where they cut it off all right now they're gonna go in just for a second rinse all right looks pretty good now we're gonna put it into the aquarium these little black pots aren't really necessary i just had them there in case i wanted to ever move the pothos out of here it'd be easier to just to pick up one little pot and you know separate them out that way uh, and also, I like to put the plants directly into the pot first before I add a bunch of the rocks and stuff in there. Uh, because if you add the rocks first, it's really hard to get the plant into the pot without having to like basically shove it through a bunch of rocks. And you risk like damaging you know the roots of the plant and making it harder for it to establish. It'll probably be fine, uh, but I definitely prefer to just put the plants in there and then gently put the rocks on top of it. So this is what it looked like when I got it all set up. And you might be asking, why would you even want to put pothos in your aquarium? Pothos are very fast growers. And if you have them in the top of your aquarium, uh, they will suck up a lot of nitrates, especially when they get big and established. And this can help reduce the amount of times you have to do water changes. And also if you're having algae problems in your tank, it also control the algae problems. One nice thing about it is the fact that the roots are in the water, but everything else is out of it. Um, there's less of a chance of the goldfish just going and just eating it all up and killing the plant a lot of aquatic plants you put in a goldfish tank the goldfish just graze through it and destroy it these kind of have the roots protected in the little pot they're in and then the leaves are outside of the water so you can have an aquatic plant without having to really have that goldfish to plant interaction which typically results in goldfish that are nice and full and plants that don't exist but anyway let's see how this works and i hope uh, i hope i can get these big enough to the point where it reduces the number of times i have to do water changes Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And also, don't forget to buy your Bubba plushie. They're only available for one more week. And I don't even know if they're ever going to be available again. So if you ever want a Bubba plushie, now is the time to get it. Uh, and also, we do got merch. Merch is always available. No urgency to buy merch, but, you know, do it to support the channel. Uh, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Luke's Goldie's out.